a very good morning friends and welcome to one of my first episode of range trek series in sayadris and uh, i am right now on my way to pawankhand from panarigad it is around 7:45 in the morning and uh, we started from panarigad at around uh, 7 o'clock and uh, we then descended from the purosti burus and now we are heading towards masai plateau I think we are halfway through the Masai Plateau. I think we must have walked around three kilometers. And uh, now there is a slight ascent, and then again the Masai Plateau will continue. This is the ascent we have to do, and then again it's a Masai Plateau. So it's around 9:30, and I thought we are done with Masai Plateau, but we are still walking, walking, and walking. Wow. So it's around 10 o'clock, and we are now descending towards Kumbarwadi. So it's around 10:35, and I think we have covered around. Four kilometers from Kumbarwadi to Kathiawadi. So it's around eleven uh, twenty-five, and uh, and we have crossed another village. We have to cross a pair of ten more villages, so it is going to be a task. So it is about uh, it's around 11:45, and we have crossed all the villages which were connected via the tar road. Now we have come back to the trail. So 
इट्स अराउंड ट्वेल्व ओ क्लॉक एंड इट्स बिन हाफ एन आवर और अभी तक कोई विलेज नहीं आया है बट हाँ वी हैव टू क्रॉस दिस वॉटर स्ट्रीम इट्स लुक्स अभी इंटरेस्टिंग So it's around uh, 12:25, and uh, we have reached another village. I asked the local guy about how long the route could be, and uh, he told us that he will reach Pawan Kin by 5 o'clock. So we are considering it as 6 o'clock. So six hours of more trek in this rain. Hope for the best. It's 12:55, and uh, we have now reached Bhangarwadi. It's around 12:55, and we have reached Bhangarwadi. So we have now met Bhangarwadi, and uh, we are moving towards Andrewadi or Andrewadi. It should be there within next 15 minutes. So it's been 15 minutes into this jungle, and we are still walking. So this this particular jungle trail is uh, quite famous for leeches. So whenever you are doing Kanagar to Vishalgar, remember to carry salt, as it will help you to remove leeches. So the rain has increased quite a lot in the jungle, and hope it doesn't add to our troubles. We have been walking, 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 and walking for last, I think, 45 minutes in this jungle, and we are about to reach our next village, which is Ambawadi or Amrawadi. Let's see. Hope for the best. Around 2:50, and uh, we have now left Hambewadi. We had our lunch, other whatever we have we had brought, and uh, now we are moving towards Pawan Kin again. So it's around 3:40, and uh, we have now reached Ringewadi. It seems like it will take more 
आपल्या स्टोरीज पांड पाणी Twelve minutes, we have reached Mayawadi, and uh, now I think there are only three villages left before we reach Pandu Pandi, which is the closest village to Pawan Khan. around 4:15 and uh, we have reached pattewadi so it's around 5 o'clock and we are still walking we are still walking we are still walking A very good morning friends yesterday at around 5:30 all my batteries drained out and uh, i had power bank actually to charge it but, but the rain was so heavy that i couldn't charge it anymore anyways so even after 5:30 we trekked for almost 2 hours more and uh, we reached a village known as pandarpani which is the closest village to pawanken and uh, we stayed there last night and now we are going to pawan khe which is around 4 kilometers from here so let's see enjoying the morning beauty the greenery the dark clouds and the beautiful road So after 5.30 when my battery drained out, we trekked for 2 hours and during those 2 hours there was a big jungle patch which was very dark. I mean people talk about Andarban but Andarban is nowhere close to that jungle patch we had and then we had a village then we trekked again on the trails and again a village. And finally we came to a tar road from where again you have to walk for 2 2 kilometers more. So yeah. So so to brief about the trek, 2/3 of the trek is well marked. But the last 1/3 which is say roughly around 10 to 12 kilometers is not marked properly and as your body is tired by then it adds on to a trouble. Overall it is a very good trek and hats off to Shivaji Maharaj and Baji Prabhu Deshpande who not only just walked along the trail but also escaped from a Siddhi Jaws army so hats off to them again <laughs>
and this is the Gorkhand or the pass which was defended by Paji Prabhu Deshpande along with 300 Mawas against an army of 10,000. They defended this pass for 10 long hours. At 6 pm, Shivaji Maharaj fired 3 long shots from the cannon, indicating his safety at Vishalgarh. It was then that the brutally injured Baji Prabhu Deshpande left his life with the satisfaction of sacrificing in a successful cause. Not to forget Fulaji Prabhu Deshpande and Shiva Kashid, who also sacrificed their lives in this escape. A salute to their braveries.